Yo, what's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another episode of the Bryce Young Player Lock franchise. And we are going into what the media calls the Super Wild Card Weekend. It's just Wild Card re Weekend here. And we're going up against the Chicago Bears, a team that I did not expect to ever see in the playoffs. But here we are, sneaking in uh, with a 9-8 and eight record. Uh, we are a two-seed. No, no, we're not. We are a five seed, I think. But we're the best five seed. I believe we're a five seed, right? Only reason we're not a one seed is because the Tampa Bay Buccaneers in our same division won the division, had a better record than us. But we're going up against the four seed Chicago Bears. But we are, a, a, statistically speaking, a better team. So it's going to be an interesting matchup to say the least. Good thing for us. We have an upgrade going into this game. So let's knock this out before we get going. I think we want to obviously do the scrambler like we always do. And forgive me if I sound a little weird when I talk. I have like a sore in my mouth, inside my mouth up here and under my tongue. I, I don't know why I have two sores in my mouth, but I do it sucks it hurts uh but it is what it is um and thank you for being patient with me not putting out a video on monday uh i've been having some internet issues i am very surprised that we're actually able to do this now because this uh chicago or this uh this franchise is it actually um a cloud saved into the cloud and there's something going on with my router it's ca causing issues to log into the playstation network at t says my router is offline, but I'm still getting some internet. So they're sending me a new router, but apparently it decided to start working or at least logging me in here to, to this. So we're actually an away team, which uh, is weird. We're going to go with the full white, color rush whites. Yeah, baby. And jump into some uh, football. So yeah, I... I Oh, it's snowing. Here we go. This is what I'm talking about. Super wild card weekend here in Chicago in a snowy day. Going against Justin Fields. Bryce Young there. See, I've just been, I got a headache. Sores in my mouth. I don't know what's going on. I'm falling apart, guys. Falling apart. Right, Wi-Fi's not working. Dallas Cowboys suck. They lost their playoff game against the Packers. Don't want to talk about it. But uh, this is going to be a fun game going uh, here in the snow. I wouldn't put it past the Bears to beat us either. I'm trying to remember, did we play them during the regular season? I do not remember. I do think we can win this game. We should win this game. Man, my head really hurts today too. I, I don't know what's up. But we're going to we're gonna play some football. Hey, look. Football players can play with the flu. Man, we can play. A lot of snow in Chicago. It's kind of cool. We'll get to see this. Either get more snow or less snow as the game progresses. I would assume. Hopefully, that's what happens. So far, they've been able to march down the field, but they do stall out. They're going to have to punt the ball away. And the Carolina Panthers are going to take the ball on the 16-yard line. And I'm not, I wonder, I'm curious what kind of defense they're going to run against us. And then you got to try to figure out how to stop Miles Sanders. He's been a force to be reckoned with all season long. We get six yards on the play there, but we do have an injured offensive lineman. Moten injured on the play. He's going to take it to the uh, locker room. These uh, offensive linemen get hurt every play, every game. So it's nothing new for us. Second and four, ball in the 22. Another running play to Sanders up the middle. Big gain there. And he has 19 yards on the ground already in this game off of two, two attempts. All up to the 35-yard line. I'm hoping that we can run the ball most of the game due to the snow. It's going to be hard to throw the ball. Adjustment at the line. Uh, Bryce Young under center to take the snap and a stretch play to the left side. Sanders making the corner, and he's going to get... He has some daylight there. And that was, uh, what, a 19-yard run. 
so so far they have no, had no answers for the running game it looks like the uh carolina panthers are going to run again on first and 10 from the 46. stretch play again to the left side and more big room for him as he's going to get another 10 yards on the ground So a new set of downs again. We're going to keep running it. Eventually, they come up into the box, and we'll start passing the ball. But if they don't want to stop the run, we're not going to, uh, uh, you know, make any changes. Three yards on the play there. Manageable. I mean, three yards every play is like I've always talked about. That's manageable. It's going to give us a force of fourth and one. I'd be happy with that any day of the week. Takes a snap. Oh, Michael Thomas was a little more open there. Third and seven now. Mm, Y'all aren't going to like this play, I don't think. Third and seven. We're going to run a draw. This is a bad snap. Sanders has room. Follows his block, and he gets the first down. He already has 65 yards, and that's all from this one drive. Bears just don't know what to do. They have not been able to figure out how to stop him yet. First and 10, ball in the 20. Snow coming in. Oh, that is not where we wanted that pass. That was really bad. Like I said, I think it's going to be hard for us to throw the ball. Second and 10 now. I don't know why I'm not getting mesh as an option either. Young making some adjustments. Takes a snap. It's a hint. No, it's a fake. Oh, that's the wrong wrong guy look at miles sanders look how open he is we're 0 for three passing the ball all right we got to build some confidence here very quickly as rice yelling has uh has zero confidence in himself right now third and 10 ball is 20. i'm just gonna take the snap it's gonna be a screenplay and that's gonna have some room for him to run does he get the first yes he does oh barely so that's what we need we need to start we need a couple more dump offs like that allow uh bryce young to really get in a rhythm uh boost his confidence and uh then we'll probably start seeing some better some better stuff from him through the air and we are slowly methodically moving our way down the field got a focus trying to run the ball every time they, they have decided now that they do want to bring uh eight in the box and we threw that oh my god didn't even see that guy Second and goal. Ball in the nine. Another play action. We got to get rid of it. And we might have to settle for a field goal here. It's third and goal, though, so we still have a chance. Let's see what we can do. Another screen. Follow your block, buddy. Follow your block. <sighs> okay. All right. Well, we, we can't pass the ball right now. That's more on Bryce Young and me. Making bad reads and bad throws. Um, so, we'll, we'll settle for the field goal. And we'll come back and uh, establish the pass a little bit more shortly. So we do get the three points. So that's going to put us up by three. Fourth and one. And here we go. We get the ball back. Good let's stuff. Go. Well, 
Let's drive down and try to put some more points on the board. So we do get seven yards on that completion. The second, that gives us a second and three. That's something I'm liking. And Miles Sanders with a big rush there. So he's averaging 10 yards a carry. Because he has seven attempts for 70 yards. First and 10, handoff to Sanders again. Oh, he finds a good seam there. He gets seven yards. That's again, another, another second and three. We're about to come to the end of the first quarter. It's, I feel like it's really dragged out. I think that's because we've had the ball most of the first. Stretch play. Sanders gets the first. He's going to get tackled. We really expect him to be the workhorse in today's game. So far, that has been the case. Now let's go ahead and let this clock run out. Man, I got to figure out how to get rid of this headache, too. So, first and 10. And we're going to run. We were going to run the ball. Spent way too much time. Dump it over quickly to Sanders so he has time to make a move. They have definitely adjusted to the run. Second and eight. We got two yards out of that. I feel like we really got more than that, but it is what it is. There it is. Sanders with a... Wow, he's still going? Oh, he's going to take it to the house. I did. I don't know how he broke that tackle. I thought he got tackled back there, but he just kept going. Let's see if they show a replay of this. Look at how much snow is in the end zone. Oh, doing the stanky leg or something. I don't, I don't know the names of all those dances. So right here, I felt like he had it. Yeah, he, but he just kept going. He just kept trucking. And he's going to take it to the house, give us a 10-0 lead in the uh, second quarter. And that definitely makes the highlight reel for Carolina and the Panthers. Carolina Panthers. All right, so I was making sure I got a replay of that too. What was that like? That was like off, almost a fifty, or it was over a fifty-yard run, I think. Fifty-three, I think it was. Second and ten, third and six, fourth and six. Look, we're gonna keep running the ball. There's no reason for us to pass the ball in this kind of weather unless we have to. And Miles Sanders is just playing lights out. He really is. Actually, we're going to pass the ball here. Thielen's going to hit the corner. So now we're see we're starting to get Bryce Young in a little bit of a rhythm with these uh, drag routes, these underneath routes, and hopefully that'll that might open up the game a little bit here uh, in the second half. Uh, why are you cutting that back, man? Mm, he gets a yard. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Okay, second and nine, ball on the 33-yard line. Young under center, tied in, lined up to the left. Sanders, the lone back, takes a snap, hands it off to the left side, and there it is, Sanders again with a 10-plus yard run. 
And I just Chicago has no answer at this point in time for the running game. That definitely was the appropriate game plan as running was the game plan and it has been working to perfection. Sanders has 152 yards in the first half alone. I don't know what I don't know what Chicago is going to do in the second half, but they've got to make adjustments. Sanders slow to get up there. I think it might be more so just because he is uh, tired from taking all these carries. Second and two. Get that right into the seam, and he bounces off a man. He gets a few extra yards after the uh, deflection. <laughs> I mean, basically deflected off the defender there. He did, not the ball. You take another look at this. Boop, just bounce. I mean, that's what happens when you don't wrap up. If you don't wrap up when you tackle, that can happen. You can see you see it there. This textbook example. First and ten. Ball on the twenty-eight yard line now. And just about two yards on the play. Ball in the 26, second and eight. Sanders pretty tired in the backfield, but we're gonna keep working him. We'll get that back up in there before too long. And we'll work that guy. Cause they have no running game. Or no run defense, I should say. Third and three. What what is the substitutions? I wish I could go in and make those adjustments, but I can't because I'm just a player and not a coach. But I would love to see uh, a substitution at some point. And here we go. Finally, finally get the substitution that we needed. Andrew Pierman. And, and uh, at tailback, first and ten, ball on the fourteen. Let's see what he can do. He hasn't had too many carries yet this year. He gets two yards there, and this is a time for big players to show up big time, including the backup players. And that's in the playoffs. Second and eight, ball on the twelve. They're bringing some men up. We're going to run to the strong side and get uh, three yards on the play. May come off a little boring today, given the fact that it's a blizzard here in Chicago. And that makes it hard to pass the ball unless we can dump it off, do something like that. But we can't even can't even complete those passes. And I don't know why he's celebrating. He didn't do anything. That was just a bad pass. It's just an inaccurate pass by our quarterback. So uh, I would assume we're going to settle for the field goal. Now we go. We end up going for it. Okay. Here we go. The first goal. Ball in the four. Three minutes left in the second quarter. Sanders trying to be patient back there. Make a. Wait for the play to develop and gets uh, two, three yards on the play. That's going to be a second goal from the one. What is that? What What is going on there? You don't even turn around to look and see where the ball is. So now we got third and goal, and our coach wants to run out of shotgun. Man, we don't have the best offensive coordinator, I'm telling you. All right, well, let's see what happens. He gets it in, luckily. I was a little nervous. Not going to lie, a little nervous about that one. So Sanders with two touchdowns on the ground. We're going to go up 17 to nothing. 
And with just a couple of minutes left here in the first half. All right, so. Looks like they're trying to make something happy here, uh, happen here. They're moving the ball ever so slightly, but there is 36 seconds left after a big sack. Fourth and five, they're going to have to kick a field goal. And we're going to get the ball with 23 seconds. We'll just run the clock out. Oh my God, he's gonna almost broke that one for a touchdown. So we're gonna let this one take us to halftime. Then we'll come back with getting the ball in the second half. Jesus, that coach is not happy. Be happy you made this, got this team to the playoffs. I mean, really, that's, that's what should be happy. 200 yards rushing. I don't know where their de uh, rush defense is, but it's it didn't show up to this game. That's for a fact. We win this game. I, we're probably going to take on... Well, I guess it depends. Who do we take on? Probably the Rams or the 49ers. No, I don't think that's who we'd be taking on. I'm not really sure. All right, so here we are. Starting off the second half, Miles Sanders has gotten plenty of rest. Carson Tim from the 25. So we get about a yard on the play, second and nine. And they have, oh, look at that. Big play by Sanders, and he finally gets a uh, tackle from behind. Sanders, a little upset that he wasn't able to break that one for the long one, but he gets a good amount of yards out of it and gives us another first down. Ball on the 40-yard line now. Sanders been in the zone pretty much this entire game. And we're going to go deep to him. Oh. Almost. Almost. That might come back to bite us in the butt. Ready, ready. Second and 10 ball on the 40 yard line. Ready. Other hand off to Sanders as, as it's been the whole game. <laughs> I mean, he gets another first down. I don't know what Chicago's doing. You would think they'd made adjustments in the second half, but at least defensively, they haven't. Maybe they have offensively. That might be the case. I don't know. He gets another 10 yards. 25 attempts, 240 yards on the ground. I mean, he might have over 300 yards in this game when it's all said and done. I would love to go ahead and take him out, give him some rest, but the computer does not want to do that. The first and tip on the 35, we're going to hand it off to him again. Maybe see if we can get him on the sideline, get a backup in there. No, no, I guess not. Second and eight. What, is, what do you have to do? I mean, I think I could go in and make a substitution. But what a catch! And they're gonna call it a touchdown. Play action crossing <coughs> to Michael Thomas, 
and he comes up big for the touchdown. We get another look at it here as he just burns the man deep. What a good pass by Bryce Young. One of the better passes he's had today. Probably the best he's pass he's had today. And Carolina going to go up 24 to 3 after that extra point. Whew. Extra point is good. So 24 to 3. Curtis Roundtree with return. Actually, a touchback. Dalvin Cook. On the ground, getting a couple of yards here and there. Oh, they have Odell Beckham Jr. too, huh? Braxton Jones with a penalty for the sack or something. I didn't see what it was. We pass third and 10. So we're going to, they do end up scoring. But I mean, you know, scores 24 to 10. So Okay, so second and four after a six-yard rush by Sanders. Ready. He's going to get around the corner on that one. Okay, so second and 10. I'm sorry about that, guys. Second and 10. On the 37. Let's see what we can do here. Do we run another screen? Oh, you almost didn't turn around in time. Come on. You let go of your block too early there. Now we're going to have a third and eight. Okay, so third and eight. What do we, what do we go with? Will we try to run another screen. Is that stupid? Third and eight ball on a 39. Somebody block this guy. All right, that's fine. We're up by 14. Man, I, I, I mean, that's probably my fault for running the screen so many times. Okay, so they didn't, they didn't, I mean, whoa, turnover. First and 10 on the 22. Why are you, why, why, why? Let's go. Mm. 
Let's see. Can we run skinny post here on second and five? And they're going to say he's in there. And Jonathan Mango gets the touchdown. So, it is now 31 to 10. Fourth and two. And they get a five yard rush. Ah, oh, come on now. They're going to march right down the field and score on us, huh? I mean, they got the ball on the three, third goal on the one. Can we get a stop here? No. All right. I, mean, I feel like we got to keep scoring, huh? All right. First and 10. We got just under seven minutes left to play in this game. And they've decided they want to stop, like, finally stop us running the ball. <sighs> and so that's tough. Do I pass? Do I, like, start passing the ball here? We're up by, I mean, we're, we're up by quite a bit. They're going to say this is a fumble, huh? We're about 14. It's not a quite a bit by any means. That's okay. All right. Well, all right. Maybe I, maybe I run it there instead. Maybe I take off running. Maybe I scramble. What, what do I do there? Let me know in the comments. What, what should I scramble? Should I be just running on second and 12? I mean, they're probably going to pass the ball. Or uh, a score touchdown here. Fourth and goal. Are we going to hold them to a field goal? They went for it and didn't get it. Oh, this game's over then, right? Got the ball on a three. So we just, we just got to run the ball here. No if, ands, or buts. Let's not make the same mistake as we did in the last series or the last drive. Yeah, series drive. It doesn't matter, right? I feel like there's holes there and Miles Sanders just decided he's not going to run through them anymore. Is that, does that seem like that's the case to you guys too? I don't like that one bit. I don't like that one bit. I, I feel like we could have got it over that guy's head. Fourth and seven. We got to punt it away. I mean, they could easily score and be down by a touchdown. We somehow managed to hold them on the last drive. Incomplete pass. Second and 10. Third and 10. Oh, 
Okay, so they do score. They're trying to make this a close game, huh? But there is a minute 51 left. So, really, a first down here should seal the deal. And they're, they're, I mean, okay, that might be too early for a first down. A couple of plays, then a first down is what I was really alluding to. First and 10 ball in the 39. They did call a timeout. But we will have to get another first down, I think, because we got that one too early. We got another first down. Wow. I mean, he might. I don't know how many yards he has. But he's decided to come out here in this drive and get some yardage. All in the 50 now. They use their second timeout. Ooh, we get five yards. That's what I like to see. Second and five. Ball on the 46 now. Ooh, a first down. Okay, so if we get a first down here, that all but seals it, I think. They've used all their timeouts. They have to score. They have to get the ball back and score a touchdown. But we're going to make them work for it. Definitely a first down here would be big for us. Even if they don't get a, we don't get a first down. I mean, I think it's a pretty good shot. Oh, nice juke! There it is. Miles Sanders with the juke of his life, knowing that the game potentially could be on the line if they don't convert. And he does. He converts, and we're gonna have to snap the ball one more time, and we are going to move on to the divisional round. We're going to take this down to the last bleeding seconds of this game. Cold day in Chicago. Snowy. Man, what a what a game this was. Yeah, Bryce Young, Miles Sanders come out and play big. I believe two touchdown passes. Two. Uh, along with two rushing touchdowns. Carolina is going to win the wild card 31 to 24 over the Chicago Bears. Coach consoling his team. And uh, guys, what a great game this was. So happy that we won this one. We're going to be moving on to the next round and stay tuned. We're going to have this game. Uh, we should have the next one coming out on Friday. Uh, so stay tuned to that. Let's see who we go up against. I don't know who we go up against, but we're going to do it. Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up. If you're uh, new here and you like it, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. And as always, until next time, y'all have a good one. Peace.